bit of a different day today. You've got Jimmy Bullard and his uh, crew bar behind you. It's quite a nice thing to do, really, isn't it, at times? Yeah, it is, but the most important thing was that uh, we got our work done, you know, and concentrated on Saturday. That's just a bit of an added bonus for the lads. And um, at the end, Jimmy joined in the training this morning and still, it still looks as I could do a job. Yeah, he won't be signing on for you, though, I guess. Never know. No. <laughs> Brilliant. Yeah, moving on, Saturday, old cliche, another huge game and it's not going to be an easy one. There's no easy games is there in this league, we, we've not had one yet and um, I don't think there is any because every team's desperate to, to get results and Macclesfield have had a brilliant result at Walsall last week in the FA Cup and um, we've got some good players and it will be a really tough game for us. Yeah. With their, them being in the FA Cup and obviously like you said, great result, as a manager or as a player, do you is it a distraction the FA Cup? Does it affect your league form, do you think? It can do. It can do, but I think it's it's fallen far enough away from the next FA Cup game that they can really concentrate and keep themselves up and around the top of the league. Yeah. Looking back to last Saturday, you said to me in our interview it was a really important win because it, it just gave you that little bit of, of a points cushion with everyone else not, not playing. So yeah. Yeah, it is important, but, but it's not it's only important if we keep going because that league can soon get eradicated we have to make sure that we we stay strong keep doing everything right that we have been doing that's put us where we are and uh, it's up to me to keep on top of the players and make sure that they're they're fully at it and it is a busy schedule again next Saturday Lincoln then Tranmere in the week so yeah. Um, these are the games you, you want to be playing in and you know you're, you're more than capable of beating these teams you're top of the league we've got four big games they're all big games but four tough ones you know in, in Macclesfield Lincoln Tranmere and Wrexham you know and they don't come much bigger than that at, at this level so we have to make sure we're on it and uh, the whole squad is ready to play and, and we try and get as many points as we can out of that I popped in the physio room before I spoke to you there was nobody in there so good news Good news, yeah, we got like uh, Fab, hopefully, will be involved the weekend. Driss is trying to shake his uh, kick-off he got, but uh, there's not too many problems at the minute. The good thing was, though, when Driss did hobble off, he brought Rob Sinclair on, and as you said on Saturday, he, he, he really hit the ground running. Yeah, Rob has uh, been in my office about 25 times over the last few weeks, wanting to play, and he's, uh, he's, he's a student of the game, Rob and um, he's a good player and uh, he did really well when he came on the Saturday so uh, hopefully more of that. Okay, cheers Mark. Thank you. Cheers, Here you go.